ladies and gentlemen, is a copy of Gangs of New York. I am a huge Scorsese fan, but I can't say that this was my favorite Scorsese movie. The plot's weird, the history is kind of compressed, to say the least, but I'm going to watch it over and over again because the costumes, the sets, and the interpretation of Manhattan during the Civil War is absolutely stunning. Or at least it was in the theater, because the original Blu-ray release that came out in 2008, which looks like this on the rack, well, was awful. A 50 gigabyte disc it looked like a poor 4.7 gigabyte DVD transfer because it pretty much was a recycled DVD transfer. Oh, the pain, the agony, and the suffering. However, there is a remaster that came out early in February. The remaster, which has a big Miramax award-winning collection banner across the top instead of the 10 Academy Awards nominations, and it's black instead of blue, gets rid of the digital noise reduction set to 11, the wonky coloring, the ridiculous edge enhancement. Oh my goodness, everybody's got halos in the first version, and the overall lack of detail, which is really frustrating. When you have a big, beautiful 1080p screen, you want things to pop. You want all of that beautiful work on the sets to pop, and the original version looked like the ass. Now, you want to see what we're talking about up close? There are lots of great side-by-side -side screenshots comparing the original release on Blu-ray and the new master release, or the newly mastered release, the one that just came out, the, the one we told you about, the new one that looks like this. They're up at highdefdisknews.com. We've got a link in the show notes. Folks, we're going to do our best to warn you when a Blu-ray disc isn't looking like a clear improvement over a DVD, at least if we can get our hands on it before it releases. And i got to say this right now, a lot of 80s movies we grew up with are always going to look ugly, partially because of the cinematic style, partially because of a lot of cheap film stock, but the newer stuff should look good. If they're shooting it recently, they should have a decent master. We'll see.